dream world. This is the world as it exists today. Welcome to the desert of the real. The Matrix is a system. That system is our enemy. But when you're inside, you look around and what do you see? Businessmen, teachers, lawyers, carpenters. The very minds of the people we are trying to save. But until we do, these people are still part of that system. And that makes them our enemy. Throughout human history, we have been dependent on machines to survive. Fate, as it seems, is not without a sense of irony. Tomorrow, we may all be dead. But how could that be different from any other day? This is a war, and we are soldiers. Death can come for us at any time, in any place. Now consider the alternative. What if I am right? What if the prophecy is true? What if tomorrow the war could be over? Isn't that worth fighting for? Isn't that worth dying for? This is your last chance. After this, there is no turning back. You take the blue pill, the story ends. You wake up in your bed and believe whatever you want to believe. You take the red pill. You stay in Wonderland. And I'll show you how deep the rabbit hole goes. Do you believe that my being stronger or faster has anything to do with my muscles in this place? Do you think that's air you're breathing now? Have you ever had a dream that you were so sure was real? What if you were unable to wake from that dream? How would you know the difference between the dream world and the real world? If real is what you can feel, smell, taste and see, the real is simply electrical signals interpreted by your brain. Sentient programs, they can move in and out of any software still hardwired to their systems. That means that anyone we haven't unplugged is potentially an agent. We have survived by hiding from them, by running from them, but they are the gatekeepers. They are guarding all the doors, they are holding all the keys. Which means that sooner or later, someone is going to have to fight them. Welcome to the Matrix.